Right, so we're just doing some testing on our 3UZ remap TCUs. In this particular case, what we're looking for is the operation of the ACIS. So this is to make sure that when we do swap these for a manual configuration, so you can see the harness here, this is designed for a manual. There's obviously zero gearbox wire, and we've got zero gearboxes here. There's nothing that's plugged into the ECU in terms of the automatic gearbox at all. Um, so what we're basically gonna do is we're going to start up the engine. We're gonna rev it to above 4,700 RPM and more than 60% throttle. And what you're gonna notice is this ACIS valve will close as soon as I start it. That'll make the intake runner length the long distance. And then as soon as we rev it up, it's gonna then pull up again to fully open. And then that's gonna have the short intake runner length, which is what you want at the high RPM. Okay, so I'm gonna put my earmuffs on because we're obviously gonna rev it up. I have warmed the engine up, so I'm not abusing you. I'm not revving the crap out of it from cold. So yeah, let's get this done. So just give me a second. All right, so we'll put the ignition on. And then obviously important to remember that I'll show you there's no engine codes either. So even though it's manual, there's no engine codes for automatic gearbox on there. Let's start her up. And there you go. Sorry, the first time I didn't press the throttle down enough, I'm trying to do it by my hand. <laughs> but yeah, so you can see as we go above 60% throttle, so even if it's above 4,000 RPM, it won't open unless the actual throttle is above 60% as well. Okay, so that's all working as it should do. Again, 3UZ, six speed, Toyota Crown, remap for manual, ACIS is fully working as it should. All right, thank you guys for watching, and we'll see you later. Bye-bye.